What's happening people? Today in this video, I am going to tell you three tips, excuse me, I, I can't count, three tips on how to make more money uh, as a Grubhub driver. So we're going to do this unedited and we're going to jump right into it. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and hit that like button if you found this to be informative. So number one, you're going to want to work during the dinner hours. That's when people are tipping the most. Uh, they're typically ordering food for not just themselves, but also their family, friends, whoever they're with. And uh, typically these hours, from what I've noticed from working with Grubhub for almost two months, um, is between like 4 o'clock p.m. to like roughly like 9.30 p.m. Occasionally you will get those people that order, you know, past 10 o'clock, 10.30 or whatever. But typically between 4 to 9.30 is usually when you get the big dinner rush. Um, number two, stay closer to where more of the busier restaurants are. I feel like this kind of is basically pretty obvious. Um, stay closer to city areas or if you know a particular restaurant that you find yourself going back to like more and more and more, stay closer to that because typically uh, the dispatcher who they say is an automated system, but I think there's a person operating it, but I could be wrong. Um, they're going to throw you more orders. Okay. And uh, number three, grab as many blocks as you can as soon as they are released to you because uh, I'm not sure if you know this, but it works where uh, based on your acceptance rate, your attendance, and your drop block rate, uh, every week the blocks uh, for the upcoming week schedule are released at different times. Um, like me, I'm a premier driver now. At first, I was in the general setting. So I get to choose my blocks for the upcoming week on Thursday mornings at 10 a.m. Like between 10 and 10.15 is when they release it for me because I have a perfect acceptance rate. I don't drop any blocks and I'm always on time. It's really, really important to do all those three things. Um, and for general people, like when you just start, your blocks will more than likely be released on Sunday mornings at 10. So you kind of have to pick up the scraps from whatever's left. But I would recommend you grab as much as you can, work all of your shifts, clock in at the right time, clock out or go unavailable at the wrong at the right time. Excuse me. Never a minute earlier, never a minute later, just always on time and you should be good. Now, if you follow these three things, uh, you will absolutely make as much money possible. Um, I'm going to go into uh, other videos about explaining more of this stuff in depth. Uh, if you have any questions for me that you want answered, let me know in the comments section. Please write legibly so I can understand your question because uh, Grubhub, although it seems very simple, there can be complicated aspects and variables uh, that have to do with it. So... With that being said, uh, that's it. So if you made it to the end of this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe, and today's secret comment code is going to be the food dude. Comment that down below or whatever the view count is on this video. And uh, with that being said, I will see you all next time. Thanks for watching.